Hey guys, I wanted to do a PM skincare routine. You guys are always asking me what my skincare routine is, so I'm gonna give it to you. I will say my skincare routine changes frequently, so make sure you're staying up to date with all of my tips, tricks, things I share on my Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube. But I am gonna show you my staples tonight, things that I will always have in my regimen, regardless of the new things that come. So stay tuned because I'm gonna wash my face off. It would feel good because I've had quite a day. First off, I can't stand when my hair is down whenever I'm washing my face. Let's see, sometimes I have a band close by. We'll use this one. They got my earrings because they don't need to get wet. So I have makeup on, not a lot of makeup, but still. I like to start my regimen with a cleansing balm. Uh, Clean It Zero by Vanilla Co. is one of my absolute favorites. Another top favorite is Pharmacy Green Clean. People rave about this one. It is definitely a great one, but I don't know. I always end up going back to Vanilla Co. I'm gonna have to do a price check on them and see which one's cheaper. Elemis also sent me one, but I'm not gonna use it in this video. That will be for a future video, so stay tuned. But for now, we're gonna go ahead and use the Clean It Zero by Vanilla Co. I get it about that much. And this stuff lasts me a long time, so this just goes on dry. This is gonna help me get all that extra makeup off. Like, it's so gentle, but so effective for your eye makeup. And I just use my fingers so that I'm not pulling out a bunch of eyelashes. But yeah, I mean, it's okay if you get mascara everywhere, because we're gonna rinse it off. <laughs> I'm also gonna go down my neck a little because today I put on some makeup on my neck. I wanna make sure I get it all off. Okay, so this is my Cosmetics Elite Gentle Cleanser. I always scrub really hard, not hard, but I always scrub a lot more on my nose because that's where my blackheads tend to come in. Um, I like to dry my face off with a beauty, or I mean a makeup towel. I think this is the makeup eraser. That way I get any extra makeup off my face. I know a lot of people use these like and rub their face to take their makeup off. I just use it to dry my face because I try to be as least, the least abrasive as possible. This is one of my all-time favorite products. This is the Koji pads from Raquel Frisella Aesthetics. I have been using these pads for two years now um, and I'm obsessed with them. I'm gonna show you guys pictures of my face before I started using medical grade skincare, but specifically Koji pads. So this has Kojic acid in it. I like to cut these pads in half because they are a little bit pricey. So cutting them in half means they're gonna last twice as long. Kojic acid helps a lot with hyperpigmentation, which you'll see on my pictures, and sun damage, melasma, acne scars, anything that's going to dull your face, these are going to brighten it right up. Uh, I think they run about $200 for 60 pads. And you have to remember, I don't use these every single night. I use them probably three times a week. So that extends that 60 day period along with cutting them in half because they last longer. After that dries, next step, I'm going to use La Roche-Posay Hyalu B5 Serum. This is one of my favorite hyaluronic acid serums because it is affordable, but this brand is pretty phenomenal with the way they place their ingredients. I have only, I have used tons of their products and there's only one that I wouldn't give four or five stars to, but this is not one of them. I love their hyaluronic serum. I always go all the way down my neck. Um, pro tip from a non-pro, go to bed looking like a glazed donut. Do you see? I look like a glazed donut. It's fantastic. That is how it should be. Okay, so after we're gonna let that sit for just a moment, we're gonna let it soak in. The next step is moisturizer. I like this one. Again, La Roche-Posay. 
This is one of my favorite moisturizers from them. It's their Double Repair Face Moisturizer. I love this one a lot. Again, this is a drugstore brand and it's not the cheapest you'll find, but it is very affordable compared to some of the other stuff I have on my counter. Okay, we're gonna let that sit for a sec and then we'll do the rest. You should probably brush your tip. I need to go to bed. <laughs> you should probably brush your teeth before you start using all these products. That way you don't wipe away any of them, but I was in the moment. So next step, next step is eye cream. This is Lumiere Firm Rich Neo Cutis Extra Moisturizing Eye Cream. Just get a tiny bit and we are going to tap this underneath. A lot of people rub really hard. I just do so this tapping motion. Like look how glowy and dewy my face is. So any extra products I always put on the back of my hands. Come on ladies, keep up. Aquaphor on my lips. That's what I put on my lips before I go to bed. Okay, and that is my PM skincare routine. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like, leave a comment. I really appreciate it. You have no idea how much it means to me and come back next week for my next video.